Alright folks, welcome back to Final Fantasy X on the Mysterious JG, and we are fighting our way up Mount Gagazet. Sacred Peak of the Ronso. And on the other side is the ancient city of Xanarkin. The stately home of Charles Foster King. And Riku just got put to sleep by a Bandersnatch. Which... Titus is not strong enough to one-hit kill. Suggesting to me that even though we were supposedly over-leveled when we fought Seymour, we haven't leveled at all since then, and I think it's starting to catch up with us. Everybody but the spell users got involved there, and Yuriku is still asleep. this. I'm gonna pray Please at this whatever it is. Summoners and guardians who failed. Just saying. I am the narrator. I'm the narrator after all. Ooh. Oh, it's time for the character. I just hope you're ready. Yeah, well, we just fought these guys, but uh, it was a relatively easy battle, so let's do it again. Use a level three key sphere as uh, Riku continues to sneak closer to Nab Gill, a skill that didn't exist in the uh, Final Fantasy X. This is, of course, the National Edition. She's got a ways to go before she gets there, though. We also can't get uh, Bribe without level three key spheres, although that's a ways off too. Uh, but that's one that we'll be using to get pretty much an unlimited supply of any level of Key Sphere. It's just that, you know, we've got to get it first. Good. It doesn't grow bigger after you hit it with a counterattack. Remember, those guys, when you start hitting them, they grow bigger, and if they grow bigger three times, they blow up and do big damage to you. Really close to being dead when I finally got around to finishing it off there. Shoot! Oh, she's confused. Well, I'll let somebody else use Asuna because I don't, I don't know if that helps their uh, relationship. But Riku currently has the best uh, compatibility with Titus, and I want to get Yuna back up to that position. So. First off, let's just confirm. Oh, we don't need to. Ice is the way to go with this guy. That's not nearly enough. Wow, I don't think we're going to be able to take that thing out in three turns. That being the case, maybe we better hurry up and self-destruct it, but I'll, I'll try. Yeah, its magic defense is too high. I guess I can use Null Blaze first. 
yeah, this is, a, this is a real indication that we need to level up some more. Of course, we don't have a uh, uh, metal break either. That's part of the problem. So he should self-destruct now, and I'm hoping that he can't actually damage us because of yeah, because of that. Yeah, I'm a little worried. I'm having trouble with the regular monsters, and if memory serves, he's not the final boss or anything like that. He, she, it isn't the final boss, but one of the nastiest bosses in the game is coming. Brother. I still don't have a no encounters uh, weapon. I don't know where they drop. The mountain itself is the trial. Oh, is that how it works? Thank you so much, Lulu. Yeah, we fought them. It took a while. We were able to avoid the grenades damage through sneaky trickery, but trickery through Shibbity Crockett, but uh, it was kind of a pain in the button, I don't feel like doing it again. These guys, we've beaten this, this group of enemies twice, they're really not a challenge. Now, if this map shape doesn't indicate hidden treasure somewhere, you're just not paying attention. Okay, we haven't fought these guys yet. The, the Grats take a lot of hits to kill, kind of annoying. Grats, you really just need to kill with fire, it seems like. Once again, they uh, refuse to get the dark status put on them by uh, dark attack. You've got to use dark buster, which is annoying. What's dark attack even for? Super psych up! Yellow card, light damage, super psych up! Sorry, I'm thinking about Super Sidekicks 3, the next glory! Uh, in Neo Geo arcade game, you either saw it at the arcades or didn't. You either heard it yelling this, these phrases at you while trying to convince you to pop in a quarter, or you didn't. Super Psycho! Yeah, confuse resist stuff might be worth uh, an investment at this point. The mountain itself is the trial. Ooh, so br Ooh, Lulu, you're really, you're really making me think here. Got quite a few hit points. But he too seems to hate fire. Fire. Teach you to Don't say. 
Yeah, we got a boss coming up on Mount Gagazette where I'm thinking we want to save up our uh, overdrives for him. Bold show. Yeah, that's why right, with some bad magic using sisters. Oh, wait a second. Yep. Yeah, alright, so Titus is slightly better at something, and we're ready to find... Obtain Nebraska Sphere? I don't remember this. Take a look, it's in a book, Reading Rainbow. Hello, Yuna. I hope you are well. Did it? I wonder how old you are, now that you're watching this sphere. If you're watching you this sphere, I'm beautiful. already dead. Like your mother. I wish I could see you. So that I could look at your mother. I'm sorry, that wasn't right. That's not what I meant to say, Yuna. Look, I know I'm dressed funny, oh, but by the way, Jack and Oren send their regards. From hell. So far, our journey has been very entertaining. Of course, it is a hard journey, but I have no regrets. It is the path I have chosen. Yuna, when you have grown. You will have to find your own path. Don't just become a summoner like because I do. did. I mean, come on, that would be lame. Doors will always open themselves to those who do. And to cuties like you. Your future is yours to make. Live the way you want to. Whatever way that may be, you have your father's full support. Unless you take Yuna, up with J Jack's I idiot son. With you. I mean, come on. Sorry, my outfit's so ridiculous. Bye, honey. Orin has learned Overdrive Tornado. Hey, that was the final, uh... It's not a Jack Sphere, it's a Broska Sphere, but it's the final one of those, so we got his final Overdrive. Although with Orin, his second to last Overdrive is actually more useful, but we'll check out the final Overdrive, too. It hits all enemies instead of just one. I always used to use his final Overdrive until I read in a fact somewhere that... The Banishing Blade, second to last overdrive, actually inflicts the breaks on enemy power, magic, armor, and mental break. Tornado just does a lot of damage on all enemies, so. Against bosses, which are pretty much what I save my overdrives for, the uh, Banishing bla Blade is a more useful overdrive than uh, Tornado. Lots of little plot things that you can see here. Just little brief moments of the mountain itself is the trial, or this is where summoners and their guardians get buried when they screw up. Here's another one. Summoners that die up here aren't sent to the far plane. The summoners that play Why together not? stay together. Who would send them? They die alone. Well, their guardians are also summoners, right? I mean, so that means. Many have become fiends, and they may want Yuna's company. Well, Yuna will be fine. You're right. I should probably stop talking about dead summoners. I can't help it, it's an interesting topic for me. Okay, I think I'm not sure why I'm going this way, except there's probably treasure down here. Hey, old Google old Gaggler robots. If only there was a steal from all at the same time command. Oh good, owl bed potions. I've been wondering how I would get some more of those. They're really good, and I used a couple against, uh... When did I use them? Did I use them against Chimerageist? You guys wouldn't have seen that if I did. Um... I used them in some... Oh, I used them against a Marlboro? I don't know, I, I definitely feel like I used some. Stealing victory. With the doctor... Something, something. I can't remember what reference I was about to make. Yeah, okay, I gotta get rid of some of this crap.
Yeah, I should have sold some to the Ron, so I'll definitely have to do some sales when I get off camera. Meantime, let's steal more Elbed potions. I think that's what these enemies are for, basically, so you can steal all bad potions. Two at a time, even. You tend to steal items that Riku that's can use. Done. That's how it's done. I've mastered all of Riku's skills. Jeez. Oh, we get to hear more of that music than we normally do. Dr. Steve Rule, that's what I wanted to say. Stealing victory with Dr. Steve Rule. Doesn't really make sense as a reference, but I threw it out there. Hey! I think I recognize that guy. Did we beat this party? I don't think we beat this party. Um, stop talking. Forever. Kind of a waste of our preemptive strike, but whatever. Let's hope that Waka can still one-hit KO flyers. If not, I really know I'm underleveled. Okay, and he even got an overkill, so that makes me feel a little better. From here, let's... Uh There's no point in fighting them. I don't seem to have the firepower to kill them before they self-destruct. Let's just get out. Stole some useful items from them. That was too bad. Greetings, Lady Yuna. My name is Watts. <sighs> We have met several times before, right? Sorry about that. We've met several times before, right? Wait, what? Uh, what are you talking about? You're paying more attention to the players, you know? Not running today? Hmm. I have to carry on my brother's business. You've met him, I think. Owaka the 23rd. Merchant extraordinaire. Wait, you're that guy's brother? My brother wanted to come help Lady Yuna. We're both from some kind of temple England that's been placed on this world. Traders. They imprisoned him because of us? He doesn't regret it, though. In fact, he told me before they took him. They Don't took worry him. about me, just go help Lady Yuna. In what way did but they take him? why would your brother do this for us? Well, hey, this isn't the time for talking. There's dealing to be done. Welcome to O'Walkers. Cool, so we can sell to him. Yeah, that's basically what we're going to use this guy for. It's kind of, kind of ridiculous, but we're going to use him uh, as someone we sell to. Uh, I want to do that off camera, but just to clear some space. I'll do a couple on camera that you'll get to see. Stuff that I know is not going to be of any use to us. Or where we've got more than one of the same thing. I'm sure I've got other stuff with Dark Touch. Yeah, I never want to use that. Sadly, the ones that you want to get rid of that you'd never use are the ones that are worth money. It makes sense, but... Of right now. I will be sure to keep your brother in my prayers. He's doing the same for you, Lady Yuna. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you. I think what he says, well, he's either about to tell them that, like, 
Owaka Osun so much for getting him started. Although I think whether you pay Owaka, whether you loan Owaka Gil or not, I believe this always happens. They always show up at the end. Maybe I'm wrong about that. I'm not sure. Um, but also, a scene I'd never seen before that gives me a little backstory on this guy is uh, when he was at the far plane talking to his dead uh, sister and saying that Yuna reminds him of her. Well, if uh, Awaka's his brother, then maybe they both had a sister. Uh, well, I mean, I'm sure they both had the same sister, but maybe maybe they both have a soft spot for Yuna because she reminds them of their dead sister. It's not a huge, exciting, game-changing thing. Just uh, I played this game several times, and I don't think I've ever seen that before, so I'm kind of like, oh, hey, it's something a little new. Welcome to Awaka's. Welcome to me doing a weird pose. Welcome to Owokas. So he's just hanging around by himself on the edge of uh, Magic Booster. I don't really remember how that works, except that I think it's good. Alchemy? I think that boosts healing items. These are expensive freaking items he's selling us. Zombie ward? Uh, not too much farther down the road. That's actually going to be important for a boss battle. This is a really good item for her. But that's like most of our money. I'm a survivor. Maybe after I've sold a bunch of stuff. I mean, the whole point was that we were going to save up for, uh, to buy Yojimbo, but maybe I'll wait and do that much later. I mean, we don't really need Yojimbo at this point. Couldn't hurt anything, though. How is he faster than, uh, Titus? It's almost time to end the video. I'd like to uh, finish exploring the optional mountain stuff and then get back up to the mountain proper. sneeze wasn't too bad, or that I remember to edit it out. Either of them are possible. There, now it seems like there was a mountain path I didn't explore. I'll have to go check out later. Not much has changed in ten years. Still running away from every enemy we see like cowards. And yeah, this is the actual correct path. I thought I was taking the side path way back when I split off right before we got to once, but apparently I took the path at least further. Okay, okay. I'm, what if I just don't think at all? Would that work for you? What can I do for you? How can I not think for you? All this way, Ty only the unit's trying to take a dump. Could you guys give her some privacy? Tough. Yeah, sure, it's tough. Anyway, uh, I'd use the bathroom now. Yeah, those little moments, they really didn't bother to flesh them out that much, did they? Probably could have stolen from that one before I ran, but... Oh, I was thinking maybe this takes us down to where we were before, but... This is, like, acting like it's going to be a secret, and then it isn't, or it's a super secret that I haven't figured out. Alright, keep running. What do you want, folks? I showed you every monster battle once. Except that I never quite managed to defeat those grenades. Grenade. There was only one weapon left against the beast. Now, grenade. Grenade? Mr. Science Theater, folks. That's how it's done. That's how it's done. This is definitely the end.
definitely, I think if we go up, go up further, we sure this is the end of this area. Let's see if we can do something about that grenade. Try get rid of this Gratz first. Ooh, well, actually, keeping these guys in the party, oddly enough, could be effective as a way to whittle it down. Because Waka and Titus both have Counter Strike. Almost feels like cheating to do that. Come on, Titus. Yeah! Oh, I didn't actually mean to bring Waka out. There we go. This is what I want. And with Yuna out here, it would be even more effective, but I like the idea of having two targets with counter, both here that it could theoretically hit. Yeah, so I had to use a little bit of strategy. Certainly this isn't worth doing against this enemy every single time you encounter it. I just need to... I mean, with Booster Cactuar, or whatever that weapon's called, Lulu could probably do enough damage to... Uh, to do some good, but... Yeah, see, that really isn't that much. Is it not weak against water? Or ice? Let's get out somebody with the sensor. I think Yuna has a sensor in her weapon. Yeah. It's weak against... Let's see. It's, I think white is ice, yeah. So certainly so I ought to do something. No, it's not enough. Even now. And now that it's doing magic attacks, it's uh, not going to get countered as much. Yeah, it was working before I had ever attacked it, and it wasn't using fire, it was just using physical attacks. Then that strategy had a chance, but I think I blew it now by trying to hit it. Yeah, it's just going to do fire right from now on. I mean, obviously I could beat it with an A on or something, but...
physically attacks this time. Nope. It, once it's taken some damage, it just magic attacks, so that kind of sucks for us. I think I've blown it. I think I'm not going to be able to do this after all. Well, not without using an AM. Maybe, uh, if Titus provokes it. Hey, you! Take me off! Take on me. It's still gonna just use fire. I was hoping it would get stupid and start using uh, physical attacks again once it was angry. Or if you made it angry enough, it would, you know, self struck want that, but it would have made some sense. Fine. Doesn't look like anything else is going to work. I'll we'll have to call out the big guns. Speaking of big guns, wow, she's got an impressive ice rack. Immune from whatever that status ailment is, but damn it, I actually killed one. And we didn't get Kamari involved in that battle. No. Alright, folks, so uh, probably off camera, I'm going to uh, check the uh, path that we didn't take, which probably either leads to a treasure chest or a dead end. And. Uh, what else do I need to do? Make sure everybody's overdrives are filled because I think there's a boss coming. And there's like a little brief gap where we could play a uh, blitzball again. It's weird. And also go down there and sell a bunch of items and stuff to uh, to wands and possibly buy some new items. Maybe even backtrack all the way to Jibim, to Yojimbo, especially if I decide to grind. But. At any rate, folks, there's going to be a lot of exciting stuff happening off-camera, unexciting stuff happening off-camera, so that hopefully the next video will be super exciting. This is Mysterious JG. I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.